Hi, I'm Alois Rosario from Ping Skills. Nicholas has asked us a question about how to improve your ability to switch. Being able to switch between your backhand and forehand is absolutely vital in a game situation. And often in training, we tend to practice a little bit too much of one side or the other side. By practicing our switching, we're going to start to simulate a game situation a bit more. So what's a good drill to do to practice that switching? My favorite is double trouble. Double trouble is where you're gonna get your partner to block either one or two balls to your backhand side, and then either one or two balls to your forehand side. What's happening there is you've got a little bit of stability and a little bit of randomness as well. So the first ball, you know, is gonna come here. So you play that ball. If they play the next ball here, then you know that there's going to be the next ball into your forehand side. So that's the certainty. But after this first ball here, you're not sure whether the ball is going to come to your backhand or your forehand. So you need to be very aware, very balanced and ready to make the switch if you need to. So that is a great drill to practice exactly what you're talking about there, Nicholas, being able to cope with the changing quickly between the forehand and the backhand or vice versa from the backhand to the forehand. Another thing that's going to help you is making sure that you're watching the ball really carefully. If you are watching the ball carefully, then you're going to get better, quicker information about where the ball is. If you're not watching the ball and you're focused on something else, then suddenly the ball's halfway back and you've got to make that decision between the backhand and the forehand. So make sure watching the ball carefully all the time. It's going to